Listen, I may have 99 problems, but let me tell you this, a booch ain't one. <laughs> so today, I'm chilling with my Scobies hmm? over at Novo Brazil Brewing Company in Chula Vista, where they're fermenting tea to get you tipsy. Yes. I thought I was hanging with my scobies. This is a scoby. Yes, that's correct. That's a scoby that we use to ferment the tea for kombuchas. But what is a scoby? It's a symbiotic culture of bacteria and yeast. <laughs> oh my god. That's the scoby. This is a scoby. For the erotic pleasures of women and men. <laughs> For your stomach yeah. and it also makes you feel good up here. Yeah. There you go. Now we're at Novo, but your hard kombucha is called Nova. Nova means new uh, and we call it Nova Easy Kombucha because it's a hard kombucha easy to drink. You guys started in Brazil years ago and I noticed all this Brazilian culture around me. How does that come into play? We have that inspiring us to develop new products and tropical fruit ingredients. So we source many of those ingredients from Brazil and some locally. So the process starts with the brew house. There, the brewer is gonna brew the tea. He adds some sugar, not that much sugar, so the, the yeast can ferment it. Here is already the tea, is ready to transfer to one of the tanks for the SCOBY to ferment. Hold on, if you stare at this long enough, I feel like you can get hypnotized. You will like my stories. You will think I'm a great reporter. These are filled with SCOBY? Yes. That slimy stuff, is it? Yeah, that? yeah. And then we transfer to the bright kombucha tanks, finish the product with the, the flavor that we want. Are you guys ready? Go! Ready, set, go! Yes. Yes. Fresh. Cactus. Ooh, well, you guys have so many flavors. So we have a lot of work to do. You ready? Yes, I'm ready. Cheers. Saúde. Saúde. Nastrovia. All the kombucha for me. Mm. Oh, that's a good one. It's good, right? Oh, that's like a kind of a margarita.